Hi, I'm Dexter and we're at Finders Fair and this is Alice Powell and she is our next contemporary local artist, show series artist. So we're going to have a conversation with her. Let's go on inside. Alice, thank you again for being with us. You're welcome. Alice is going to be our contemporary local artist, show series artist starting in February and her work will be on display here from February the 7th. That's the first Thursday in February through March the 7th, and as I said, it'll be on display the whole month, and, and those, those two dates, she'll be here from 5 to 9 in the evening, and we'll have an open house, and want you to come see it, see her work. Alice, um, you've lived in this area, you said, for like over 40 years, mm -hmm. but you've been painting a little bit longer than that. Yes, sir. When you started painting, um, was there some particular thing that, that made you want to express yourself or did you just stumble across it or was it something you saw in school or what? How did it start? I just always loved a pencil ever since I was just old enough to hold one, I guess. <laughs> and then I just uh, started drawing and people kept telling me that I was talented at it. So they told me I, They told me to stop. <laughs> 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 so you're mostly you work uh, today in what you call water media as opposed to watercolor. Mm -hmm. And um, the water media means that it's not just watercolor paints. You can use different kinds of paints, but it's on it's the same principle. Right. Um, and you said something special about the paper that you use. What was that? Uh, yes, sir. I use a synthetic paper called Yuppo, uh, or Yuppo. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Um, and it, it is a slick surface, and the paint actually floats on top. Of the, mm. of the paper, and you can actually remove it with uh, a paper towel, wet paper towel, or a Q-tip wet. So you found a, a media that you like to work with. Right. Now, some of your things I've seen in the past um, were abstract, mm -hmm. and but most of them seem to be representational. Um, like this, this is a, a commission for someone uh, of their dog, and it's cute as can be. Uh, and this is a painting, there's a man here, and a group of of people it look like maybe children here, but it, it's telling a story. Yes, sir. Um, when you, not not a commission, but a piece that you're just creating, when you sit in front of a blank piece of paper, do you know what's, what what you're after? Not not always. Sometimes I do. Sometimes. Uh huh. Sometimes I apply the paint in a certain way to do a certain thing, you mm -hmm. know, to develop a certain thing. But most of the time, it just happens. I just see something in the color, and I bring it out, draw it out, and uh, work work with that. Great. I love texture. Well, I've noticed that some of your paintings, you know, even with this water-based medium, do have texture. I mentioned about them glistening and things, and, and um, so I can see that. And, and I think texture is important to a lot of art, the way that it expresses itself mm -hmm. to the viewer. So, again, we hope you'll come and meet Alice and see her work. It's, this is just a small representation of what she does. She'll have a lot of things um, for you to look at, and you'll get to meet her and ask her questions and, and um, learn about her art. And we look forward to seeing you. That's February the 7th from 5 to 9.